My name is Jonathan Pasquale, and I'm the owner of Taproom Coffee here in Kirkwood, a historic neighborhood in Atlanta. Taproom is a specialty coffee and craft beer spot, so kind of a community hub where you get great coffee, great beer, um, and uh, it's a good, good hangout spot, place where you can study or meet up with friends, have some good drinks. And one of the things that I always say is get the experience. So the, the sad story of the coffee shop dream is that everyone has it, but not everyone has the experience. And so you have people who sink their life savings into that coffee shop that they start in retirement, ends up flopping after a few months because they never worked in a coffee shop. And so it's worth it to, to go and, and get an entry level position at, if you're, if you're starting a coffee shop, at a coffee shop. If you're starting a restaurant, at a restaurant. If you're starting a gas station, go work at a gas station. Um, so being able to, to get that kind of experience, um, and especially from, from the, the entry level, from the ground, uh, the ground floor, uh, is really, really valuable uh, because th that, that allows you to see the inner workings and allows you to see the day-to-day -day and, and doing it in, in a situation where you're not, um, you're not at risk. You know, you're getting a paycheck. You're you're being paid to sling coffee or to, you know, whatever it is, fold T-shirts in a department store. Uh, but you're gaining experience that'll help you when you're the owner and when you're making those decisions, um, and and you're reaping the consequences or, or benefits of whatever those decisions are. So getting the experience that's one huge one. Um, another one would be, I, I would say, be yourself and have yourself come out in your business. Don't try to form a business that's not who you are. So uh, I like that Taproom Coffee is really an extension of my personality. I mean, I'm the one in charge of the social media accounts and I crack corny jokes on there and that's just me. And it's, it's a part of the identity of the business. Um, and, and, and in that way, it's, you know, it, it's almost take it or leave it, but not in a really um, uh, you know, snarky, or, or not a pretentious way of like that's who I am, and you know, if you don't like to deal with it, it's like, hey, this is fun, you know, like, be a friend of mine. <laughs> and there's there's an amount of vulnerability there to be yourself and have that come out in your business. Um, but I think that um, if if you are genuine with it, and if you are genuinely a nice person, <laughs> people will respect you for it, and people will. Um, they want to be your friend, they want to be your customer, and they want to come in and just share life with you. For me, that's easy to say because I, I run a business that is inherently a community center and, and hub of activity and people's personal lives intersect all the time here. But I think it, the principle can be applied to almost any other business. I mean, people have you know, the, the, the customer relationship, no matter what the business. Uh, and so wanting to, to be yourself and be genuine. No, no one wants a, to relate to a salesperson who is totally fake. I mean, people hate it all the time. You don't want to enter a business where you don't feel welcome. Um, so just like I would welcome someone in my home, I'm welcoming them in similar ways into my store. Um, so yeah, being yourself, being friendly, being open and honest, and open and honest about the mistakes because I make them every day. Um, but hopefully people are forgiving and, and they, uh, they extend an amount of grace to me in the way that I run my place because they know that I'm human and I'll make mistakes. I'm not trying to pretend to be perfect um, in life or in business. Um, but with that openness and vulnerability um, and inviting people along the journey, um, they get to experience all of that with me, the joys and the sorrows and ups and downs and, um, and uh, hopefully great coffee and great beer <laughs> along with it. So.